So when last we left, we got our little radio here to play a song for us when we press the letter key and click on the radio. So let's try that. Hit the green flag, press the letter key, and play our radio. But suppose we also want to play it on our saxophone, our trumpet. Well, to do that, we are going to have to do the same thing that we did to our keyboard, to our saxophone and trumpet. But fortunately, we don't have to do anything different to our radio because it's just going to broadcast the message. So we just have to decide that we want our saxophone and trumpet to also receive those messages and it will play the song when we're pressing those different keys. So we're going to go through and add in our broadcast messages. Let me show you how to do that again. When I receive, oh, and look, it's already written for us. So we don't have to do a new message this time. We did it all last time. When I receive C, we're just going to duplicate this, put it there. When I receive D, duplicate this there. When I receive E, this is a little bit faster. When I receive F, when I receive G, when I receive A, and the last one when I receive B. Now I have it on my saxophone. So let's hear that sound. Press S. Then I'm going to do it with the keyboard. So if I pick up the K or the S key at any point, I can make it switch back and forth between the two. Let's try that. So I can switch back and forth between instrument just by pressing a K and an S. So the last thing is to go through and do the trumpet. So go ahead and add all of those to the trumpet. I'm going to pause the video and do that myself while you do that. So now you can see I have added in all of the other notes for my trumpet and we can give this a try and try our trumpet now too. So press the green flag, press the letter T. we go so we can switch between all the different instruments and get all of those to play so that was pretty cool what if we wanted to play a different song so to make it so we can choose which song we want to play we're going to switch this event from when green flag clicked and we're going to create a new block so i'm going to click on this red block over here and click on my blocks click on make a block and I'm going to call this Ode to Joy. So that gives me two blocks. It gives me the Define block and the Ode to Joy block. So I'm going to move this over here. So now the Ode to Joy block is linked to all of the code for the Ode to Joy. And now if I want to play Ode to Joy, all I have to do is click this block into here and when I click, click green flag, it'll play Ode to Joy. So if I wanted to make a new song that was different, let's do something really simple so we don't have to do a whole bunch of notes. How about mm, Mary Had a Little Lamb? So the notes for Mary Had a Little Lamb are pretty easy. I'm going to make a new block and call it 
Oops, let me do that again. Or actually, I can just edit it. I forgot to type in the name. Mary had a little lamb. So I can define Mary had a little lamb. And to make life easier, I'm just going to duplicate this whole set of notes and put it here. And then just go through and change the notes. So the notes are A, G, F, G, A, 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 it's three A's, G, 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 three G's, A, C, C, A, G, F, G, who's my place? And three A's, A, 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 another A, four A's total. Then G, G, and then a, G, F. I'm just going to leave those two blank just in case I need them, just to make sure it sounds okay. Now we have Mary Had a Little Lamb. I only want to link Mary Had a Little Lamb. We're going to figure out how to play one and then the other in a minute. So let me hide the notes again. We just want to have Mary Had a Little Lamb in there. Hit the green flag. Press our trumpet play, and here we go. We go mary had a little lamb so if we want to play both songs one after the other okay so now that we've created mary had a little lamb we can connect either ode to joy or mary had a little lamb and have it play that song but suppose i wanted it to play both songs well to make that happen i have to do something a little bit different i need to create another block because we're going to reuse this code to have it play both of the songs and whenever we create something that is repeated and used more than once, we should always create a block for it. So we're going to create a block. And I'm going to call it play song. And I'm going to click that with the code that was connected to when this sprite is clicked. Now we can play Mary Had a Little Lamb. That sets up the song. Then we can play the song. Then we can set up Ode to Joy, and then we can play the song. And we don't need this when green flag clicked anymore. We can get rid of that. Let's hit our green flag, then click on our radio and choose, let's do the trumpet. I think the trumpet sounds good. So press T, click on the trumpet. We go it plays both songs for us and if you wanted to create more songs and add more songs you could do that as well that's all i have for now bye for now